It is my pleasure to be here with you tonight to be with some of my wonderful students and teachers to tell you about a project that we did this school year that enlightened us all and brought us together as a community. And one of the things we thought about this school year and back in November and October was the reflection story, what is my story, was the theme for this last best school year. And we thought about what is our story as Tuano, how, how do we all intertwine to make it something that people want to know about and hear about. And also keeping the idea, the idea of individualism, which was one of the things that Dr. Heron kicked the school year off with, and reiterating with the teachers at convocation and open, opening up the schools with that. So one of the things we did was to bring our school together with the Pacera Project. I have two wonderful teachers that will tell you more about that and how the collaboration, hopefully they're coming forward behind me right now, um, Mrs. <laughs> Reed. And <laughs> Mrs. Harmon Link are with me, I say Senora, I should say. Reed and Harmon Link are with me to introduce you and tell you more about what the collaboration looked like in our school. Okay. Good evening. Good evening. My name is Anid Reed. I am a Spanish teacher at Toano Middle School. I am here tonight with Toano's administrator, Ms. Tracy Jones, the World Language Teacher um, Department Curriculum Leader at Toano Middle School, Mrs. Harmon Link, and four of the students who are enrolled in the Spanish program at Toano Middle School. We are delighted to present to you our school-wide community project called La Pulsera Project, and to talk to you about our purpose in joining the efforts of the nonprofit organization called the Pulsera Project. Pulsera is a Spanish term for bracelet, in this case, a hen woven bracelet like this one, made out of a variety of materials such as leather, wool, string, and beads. The pulseras are made by young artists who live in Nicaragua and Guatemala. Many, if not all of the artists, are youth at risk who live in the set impoverished countries. The school pulsera sales, such as the ones we have sponsored at Toana Middle School, since this is our second year, help raise fund money to fund both education and work programs to keep youth off the streets and on their path to a brighter and more prosperous future. In our efforts to create a school-wide project, we were inspired by this year's district's reflection theme, This Is My Story or Esta Es Mi Historia, to ask anyone to represent their life story in written or visual form is a daunting task as and one that can never be truly uh, be completed as each one of us is living and creating our life story day by day, moment by moment. And yet, as we got involved in the process of representing our story, we discovered that although we are each unique and distinct, we all can come together to fulfill our goals as students, as a school, and as members of our global community that we know as WJCC Public School District. As world language teachers, we set out to instill a sense of uniqueness and unity. The Pulsera Project was our venue to teach about school, work, and life experiences that students in Spanish-speaking countries experience and compare that to our own. This is one school-wide project that tapped into our content area, as well as our souls, which will be imprinted in our hearts for years to come. I believe you will be just as thrilled as we are when you see the work so carefully crafted by each student and put together by the talented Mr. Mr. Peters, Tuano Middle School's art teacher. The work represents our story, nuestra historia. I leave you now with Mrs. Harmon Lake. Good evening, buenas noches. My name is Avery Harmon Link, and on behalf of all of the teachers, staff, and students at Tuano Middle School, I would like to extend our gratitude to the board for having us here tonight. We are honored to share with you the hard work and dedication demonstrated by the staff and students at Tuano Middle School through this Community Connections Project. We are absolutely amazed with the level of collaboration that took place among all of the grade levels and disciplines, with the creativity of our students, and with the beautiful pulsera that everyone in our school took part in creating. We have a video to share with you tonight, created by our talented ITRT, Kristen Barr, that demonstrates the passion of our students who so very much enjoyed participating in the school-wide project. We are thrilled that this project was able to instill in our students the idea that helping others is more about solidarity than charity, and that the importance of their education extends far beyond their own lives and will have a positive impact on our community and in the global community at large. We hope you enjoy the video and enjoy hearing from our students here tonight that participated in the project. 
Thank you, and without further ado, we present to you Toano Middle School's Pulsera Project. I'm Marvin Picardo, and I thought the Pulsera Project was such a great way to show respect and kindness, and I thought it really helped a lot of people in Nicaragua. Hi, I'm Shia. I'm in 8th grade. Um, when I first saw the Pulsera Project video, I thought it was really cool that our school is participating in a project like this, because we're helping other people from different countries. and I teach Foundations of Algebra II here at Toronto Middle School. The Pulsera Project gave us a great reason to review our perfect squares and our square roots. Pulsera talks about how people are threaded together and things they have in common to make one culture and another culture into one. And we took that a little step farther and talked about the students' roots. Hi, I'm Carrie. I'm one of Ms. Yolstead's students. And during the Pulsera, we did these four things and those equal up to us. And hi, I'm Megan. My favorite part about the Pulsera project was the math equation about myself that I separated into friends and family. Hi, my name is Melina and I'm in sixth grade. Hi, I'm Ashley and I'm also in sixth grade. What I thought about the Pulsero project, it was a little sad because people couldn't afford food, water, or money. And what class activities we did, we did math, we did Chinese equations, and art we drew ourselves. I thought it united us as a school because we all had a project to work on together and we could all help each other out with that project. Jeremy Riggs, and uh, I'm a sixth grade science teacher here at Toano. And uh, when I thought of Pulsera and togetherness, uh, I thought of a unit, what we were working on in our unit, which was uh, our carbon footprint. Because you know, as individuals, we all contribute to the composition of the atmosphere and how much carbon we put in. But uh, as a whole, you know, we're all one planet and we're all united, and we have to come together to uh, to make a difference. I'm in sixth grade, and my favorite part of the Pulsera project was my music part, because I really like music, and I think it brings out the inner me. Hi, my name is Emma Kreis. I'm an eighth grader at Tulana Middle School. I felt that doing the Pulsera project brought us all together in ways we didn't understand, even grades, social status shape, color, sizes, we all fit together in our one unified race. Hi, my name is Ashley Boquist, and after participating in the Pulsera project both this year and last year, I can definitely tell how much the project has grown and improved, making much more of an impact on the students and staff alike. First of all, last year, the bracelets were primarily sold at lunch. This year, however, the students were engaged in the project as well as the fact that they were sold at lunch. Students received pieces of paper, and they, the teachers were required to tell students to something to write or draw on the paper. Students would then personalize the drawing to be unique to them. Then, when all the drawings were completed, they were weaved together and hung up by the entrance to the school, showing unity between everybody. Also, in students' foreign language classes, the teachers talked more about the heritage and about the people that made the bracelets and where they came from. 
In the end, I believe that the Pulsera project has developed so much since last year, making much more elaborate and engaging experience for all. Hello, my name is Aaron Thompson and I am an 8th grade student at Tawano Middle School. My favorite part of the Pulsera project was in my civics class. In civics class, we work on collecting service hours and helping the community. For example, a few months back we helped build a playground in the community. It brought our class together by doing something that we all had in common and that we all like to do and discovering that we all have a lot in common. Also, doing something for the, doing something for the community helped us come together and discover that helping the community can be fun. Well, for the Pulsera project, we reflected on the service that we had done for others and drew a picture representation of our service hours. This helped us come closer together as a class and helped us come closer together to help kids in other countries that are poor and or have been war-torn. It helped everyone in our school realize that there are people that need our help in third world countries who are not doing well, and by helping them, we can make a difference and help those children and families. Hi, my name is McKinley Dowdy, and I'm an eighth grader at Toronto Middle School. For the Pulsera project, in each class we did something different inside the bracelet. My favorite class was theater. We made origami stars out of different printed paper. And it shows that as an individual, we're all a star. Even though we're all different, we can come together in different ways to help our community and make the whole sky. I like this project because it showed that we're all unique and we can come together like we did with the bracelet as Tawano Tigers to help many other people in unique ways. Hi, my name is Ryan Allison, and I am in the seventh grade at Tawano Middle School. The Bolsera Project brings the school together because when students bought the bracelets, everyone was wearing the beautiful bracelets in unity. Also, everyone contributed to the Pulsera Project by making a unique paper with all sorts of drawings and quotes. Then, every single paper was hung up in front of the office to make a big collage that ends up making the shape of a big Pulsera bracelet. We have some postcards that explain the Pulsera project. Do you have any questions? Can you come share the postcards with us? 